Hey guys, Amy here with your August swag and we've got some really cool new fall stuff out right now. Super excited about these new liners. So let's get into what is in your August swag bag. All right, so we've got four of the new gel art liners. You guys got cream, spice, latte, and coffee, and also a super polish. This could be Undercover Agent, Captivating Kitten, just one of our favorite super polishes to go underneath the art. Now, the gel liners do come in a 12-piece set, and I wanted to show you guys the set with the box. If you guys want to purchase, I'm going to give you a code, and if you purchase the rest of the set, I will send you guys the box because you're only getting four of them in swag. Um, I'm also going to give you a code for free shipping on those stripers if you wanted to pick up any of the other uh, colors. So I'll drop that code in at the end of the video. And basically just a few tips and tricks for your liners um, throughout this video. I pr I'm probably going to speed up a lot of the line work and the artwork. Um, but I just wanted to give you guys a few tips and tricks to work with them. These are 30 to 60 second cure time. If your light is newer, your 30 seconds is just fine. If your light is a little bit older or if it's just UV, not LED, I would stick with the 60 seconds. And same with if you're doing thicker lines, using more product, of course, you're going to want to cure for a little bit longer. But they're not finicky at all, super pigmented and a really nice consistency to work with. These gel liners do leave a sticky layer, so you're going to want to make sure you top coat them with matte or shiny, doesn't really matter. They self-level really well, so they don't leave any texture or anything like that on the top. You also, because they're a little bit thicker and they're so pigmented, you can sugar with them. So feel free to pour some glitter into them and cure the glitter or um, pigments or anything like that right into them. We did a lot of different designs for this month's swag. I just wanted to give you guys some inspiration, different ideas that you can use to create some good fall looks. And we'll go through and do a couple of these designs. I'll show you how we worked with the stripers and how easy they are, how they're like butter. They're quick, easy, clean, and um, they look great. Basically, I'm just starting. This is just Undercover Agent, and I'm just going to speed up through all of this. I'm just making a few swatch tips to get started. I do not wipe the tacky layer off when they come out of the lamp. I just go right into painting with the liner. And one tip that's really good, you guys know when you're working with liners, if you the harder you press, the wider the line's going to be. If you want it straight, you're going to use kind of the side of the brush and just pull. If you're wanting thinner lines, you're using more the tip of the brush and not using so much pressure. That way you'll get thinner lines. So it just depends on the design that you're doing, whether you want it thicker or thinner, or if you're wanting a squiggle or a straight line. Just kind of play with them and see what you come up with. Again, these abstracty squiggle lines are so popular right now. Basically, we're just creating a little ribbon across the nail and lining the colors up against each other. So I am curing in between every color. I just um, cropped all of that out of the video just because it takes so much time. But I do recommend like doing a flash cure. If you're doing a design that you want them to look more marbled and you want them to run into each other, that's completely fine as well. You don't have to cure in between, but the designs that I'm doing here, I wanted the color to stay and not move, and I am giving them about a 15 second cure in between each color. And remember for little fine detail work like this, just fine lines. You don't need a lot of product on the brush. The less product you have, the finer your lines are going to come out. And it really shows how pigmented these liners are. Nice thin lines. And again, I just love how easy it is. Mess free. After all of my flash curing, I will just put my top coat right on top and make sure I'm doing a full 60 second cure. Yeah. 
And again, because these are nice and pigmented and because we're curing in between, it allows you to use the second color, clean up that first line so you get nice stark lines in between each of your swirls, which just makes the entire design look so clean. Also by curing in between, if you do mess up any of your line work and you need to take alcohol and wipe it off, you're not wiping off the previous colors. So that's kind of a time saver just to give it that quick flash cure because sometimes you may, might make a line that's too thick, a line that's too thin, something you're not happy with, and it just allows you to erase it and not ruin the rest of the design. So y'all know I had to throw some animal print in here. We're just taking the lightest color, creating some random spots using the side of the brush so I get a lot of product on there. And we're just going to line around each one. Such an easy, quick design, but it's always, animal print is always in style, especially when it comes to fall nails. So just a quick, fun animal print design. And this one I'm going to top coat with matte top coat. All right, guys, so that's it. Just some quick, easy, fun fall designs. These nail liners are so versatile. So as I always say, I cannot wait to see what you guys come up with. Make sure you tag us in all your videos. If you want to take advantage of your code this month, it's going to be August Swag, all one word. This will give you free shipping if you're purchasing any of the liners. These liners will go up on the website on Wednesday of this week, just to let y'all know if you don't see them up there yet. And in the note section, when you check out, just if you're interested in getting the box, if you're picking up the rest of the set and you want the box for storage, because it is a really nice box, just me mention that in the note section and we'll throw a box in your order as well. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all next month.